eyelid or eye bag surgery, which in medical terms is called a blepharoplasty, are operations that we do on the upper eyelids and on the lower eyelids to try and reshape them and rejuvenate them. If we're just operating on the upper eyelid, this can often be uh, done under local anaesthetic or local anaesthetic with some sedation to keep the patients comfortable. Upper eyelid surgery uh, is undertaken usually through an incision in the eyelid itself, which runs from one side to the other in the crease. The excess skin and muscle is taken away from the eyelid before ensuring that all of the bleeding blood vessels are cauterized to stop any post-operative bruising and then stitches are placed in, which usually stay there for about a week before being removed. There are a large number of procedures that have also been described for the lower eyelids, and these are slightly more complicated, and they may be achieved either by making an incision in the skin itself, on the outside of the eyelid, or through the inside of the eyelid. The aim of both of these procedures is to rejuvenate and refreshen the eyelid. The simplest and the shortest operations are on the upper lids, and that can take about 45 minutes to an hour. The lower eyelid surgery can be far more um, involved and it depends which procedure uh, is chosen and how that's done as to how long the procedure takes. With any operations we can have risks such as bleeding, infection and scarring. But specifically when we're operating on the eye, we always have to discuss with the patients the possibility of blindness. And although it's exceedingly rare, it's clearly a very serious complication. And it happens usually because there has been some bleeding during the operation or after the operation, which has resulted in pressure on the eyeball itself. So in the post-operative period, we always monitor our patients very carefully, and we always make them aware that if anything should happen to their sight or their vision, that they need to return immediately to see us. The recovery period from an upper eyelid uh, surgery only is usually a week or two. There's some swelling and some bruising which settles out quite well over the first 10 to 14 days. There are some stitches in there which are removed usually about a week after surgery. And then after that, some gentle massage and ensuring that the eye is protected and looked after means that the patients recover very quickly. With the lower eyelid surgery, again, really, it just depends on the technique that uh, is elected for the patient. And the downtime or the recovery period can range anywhere from one to two weeks to several months, depending on the procedure that's undertaken. In general, the results have good longevity and uh, as long as everything's been replaced and supported where necessary, complications such as lower eyelid malposition or drooping of the lower eyelid are usually avoided.